Hey my lovelies and welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Willeke, but I also go by Go White on all of my socials. And in today's video, I want to introduce you to Celine Mayer. And as you can see from the title, she is going to be our sim for TLC's Not So Human Challenge. Originally, I had planned to post the first episode, but due to the latest patch update, several of my mods have been broken and I couldn't finish playing throughout her teenage years for the machinery intro that I've been working on. So hopefully I can film the first episode in the upcoming week as I'm really, really excited to start this challenge and show you lovelies the story I've created. I've been writing down the stories and my ideas for the series for weeks, prepping everything for the past few weeks as well, including the background story, side characters, uh, the family dynamics, everything that you will slowly see throughout the series. But as I cannot film the first episode, I decided to showcase you lovelies all of her young adult looks while going over the challenge rules. In my mind for her outfits, Celine has a few outfits, but she reuses them a lot for several occasions, as she had to buy all of her clothes from the moment she turned 16 years old. I did end up changing her second everyday outfit as I realized that it was a bit too revealing to showcase on YouTube, but I really loved how she turned out and how she looks with all of the outfits. She wears a mixture of edgy clothing that is either comfy or revealing. And for the revealing clothes, I feel she, I feel like she picked those to piss off her parents. I do think that she will slowly change her style throughout the challenge, but in my mind, she is currently an 18 year old who is experimenting with the way she looks, which is also why she has dyed her hair as she normally has her natural brown hair. So for the challenge rules, if you're not familiar with the Not So Yuma challenge, it's a let's play challenge created by Tilsi about a year ago. I will leave the link to the challenge rules in the description down below, so you lovelies can always read up on it throughout the series, as well as I will link her own playthrough of this challenge, as she has been telling such an interesting and well put together story. So you lovelies should definitely check her series out if you haven't already. But basically, the challenge is to play with one sim and you explore the different call packs as you go through the rules. I will hold off on telling the backstory as I made a few adaptations to what Tilsi wrote that I want to share in the Machinima intro. The general rules for the challenge are that you start off with a young adult that can have any gender, any sexuality, a backstory and pre-existing relationships. The sim needs to have the traits gloomy, loner and erratic. However, I will also add the traits Cat Lover and Loves the Outdoors using the More Traits and Cast mod by the Pancake One and Mazur Yuki once it's updated. For the Aspiration, you can choose your own. So I have given Celine the Occult Enthusiast Aspiration from James Simpson's Secret Occult mod for now, but I may change her Aspiration as the story develops. For the career, you can choose to be a paranormal investigator as an optional career, but I will actually have her explore one of the careers from the new Life and Death expansion pack, as I want to include this pack heavily in the story that I have in mind for Celine. For the skills, you will have to max out the medium skill, the mischief skill and pipe organ, as well as you have to complete the sugar skulls and crystal collections. But I will also be completing the Tarot Cards collection, as this is one of the new collections that is introduced with Life and Death. For the gameplay rules, you have to live in a haunted house and unlock the coffee phonetic lifestyle. Furthermore, you have to become best friends with the Grim Reaper, and as an extra challenge, get creative in summoning him, which we will definitely do. Furthermore, you have to become two occults and find a way to be human again, as well as you have to have babies with three different occults. And there are a lot of different options for this, so we will definitely be checking which ones we can go for. Finally, you have to host a cold parties every weekend, write five books about your life and become a ghost. For the ghost part, I think the new base game update and the new pack are going to definitely work as well. So that's also why I want to have to include life and death in the story to really see what the pack is about and use the features. So, hope you lovelies are excited for me to start this challenge. I hope you love Celine so far and the way she looks. I'm going to try my hardest to get the first episode out next week, Sunday. But of course, this all depends on when all the mods are updated that I want to use. 
So with that, I'm going to let the music roll and let your lovelies enjoy the rest of this video. If you like this video, click the little like button down below and let me know in the comments if you would want to try the Not So Human Challenge yourself. Uh, finally, if you're not subscribed yet and don't want to miss out on either a wholesome or chaotic video, make sure you click the little subscribe button down below and I will see you lovelies in the next one. I know you want one night to give into what you want and misbehave. I know you are looking for trouble cause here you are looking my way. I'm not a saint, I'm not a god, but I'll be sure I'll melt your heart. Don't be afraid, I'll make it high cause my love won't take you to heaven, I'll take you. I just wanna go 